Well, hey everybody, welcome back to the shop. Uh, this video, we're gonna tear down this $700 foil and try to find out what the issue is. We got more Shaster and Shaster over there. We just hanging out. Uh, sorry about if anybody gets offended at the first part of this, cause we ain't happy about having to do this again. It's like the fifth time that we've been in this transmission. But anyway, hang on, grab you some popcorn, sit back, maybe your favorite little beverage, and let's get on it. We trim it down. I'll tell you what, this will be the last damn time. Oh, fuck, I'll sit it right there. I'll see, that's good. Fuck that $700 for. <sighs> Alright, guys, um, one little thing. Let's get out of the way. The problem with this transmission is all. I was living in Tennessee, got the driver for like a couple of weeks, and then every one of the bell housing bolts fell out except this one. And it busted this case, all right? And that's when the rebuild situation came, situation came in. I was like, well, if I gotta take it out and have that welded, it's an old transmission, let's, you know, rebuild it and this this up here is good but what that guy done when i had him rebuild it has been a problem and a scourge on this little truck forever right so there's some backstory to that uh that's on it was running fine before i had it rebuilt and then ever since i had it rebuilt it's just been a piece of junk these two sons of bitches right here can get lost. I'm tired of it. <laughs> All right. So, first step. Let's get this thing flipped over on this back side. So we can get the bell body in the crap out. So, give us a minute for this. And then we'll be back. All right. Pans off. Pan off. Let's pull this out. Those hey, are off. Throw that in the trash, me. <clears throat> now, a bunch of 10 millimeter bolts. I think a 12 or 13 right here. Valve body off. The accumulator. I forget what this is called. But all that's coming out. Then we're going to flip it and do it again. All right, so we got all of our bolts out of our valve body. All right. We got our bolts out of our, you know, lock up something on here. Let's get that thing out the way. E and she'll just pop right up out of that hole. We'll lay her off the side because I gotta disconnect this. Let's take our parking paw off. Let's take our pressure cable sensor off. Uh, we gotta, uh, hang on. I forget what this is called, uh, but we got it. Yep. All right, secondary valve body coming off. I'm just having my hands are all slickery. All right, we got everything loose. Hang on, we're gonna take all this off in one shot. This is our two three accumulator, I think is what it's called. Let me get this well, darn transmission fluid. 
That's good. No, we need to stop. All right. Well, hang on. Remember, this thing's under pressure. Dun, 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 dun. Got a spring under it. Maybe it pops up and hits you right in the damn double chin. See? I know he's rooting for the, the wrong person. No. All right, there we go. Yeah. This is going to be kind of a comprehensive teardown. And then we will shoot another video on figuring out what the heck broke. All right? My wallet is broke. Yeah, exactly. All right. Now, now we're going to take this thing. Oh. I missed one. My bad. Oh, hang on. We got it. But we gotta get the secondary y'all. There we go. Alright. Out from under the wire. Then we can pull our bow body. And there's a rod right here. Right. Let's see. There. Bow body off. Accumulator off. Accumulator pistons. For those of y'all that don't know, we already put a Transmission junior kit in this transmission. Uh, we got, I ain't even worried about these balls. Because nobody needs balls. Especially if you're married. Uh, so, separator plate. All right. This is the Transgo separator plate. Yep. The guy put it in there when he rebuilt it the first time. So, I didn't have to do a whole bunch of drilling on this when I put that transgo kit in. Because most of the holes is already drilled. Get the other one off. Again, you can see, this little transmission, I mean, it ain't been long gone through. Nope. Been here, done that. Still trying to recover from it. You having fun? I'm having a damn ball. What about you? Yeah. He's learning. That's interesting, man. I'm, <laughs> I'm taking notes. Well, I'm still pissed off. This is bullshit. <laughs> All right. So, bell body off. Everything's out. We're having a little trouble getting, you know, the drive lever out. But we'll get it. Because there's a seal in here. It's got to be. But now... Let's move our attention to the servo. Let's see if we can. This might be a pain in the butt, but I'll get it. All right. So I need another day for the wait a minute. Ha ha. Nope. Didn't get it. But anyway, this ring right here has got to come out. Uh, there's a hole. Switch me. There's a hole. There's a hole somewhere on that that you can get in there and get under that ring. But this is a Corvette servo. We're gonna take this one out and put it back stop and stick this one in the trash truck transmission. Cause man, this thing hits hard in a second. Wait a minute, y'all might be upside down. 
Anyway, you hit the part of this thing. Ah! Lars trying to kill everybody. All right. Now, let's get the servo out. All right. So, we got our servo out. It was a little pain in the butt. But we got her. Now, we like. Ah! Oh, the governor. Yeah. Let's mess around with this for a few minutes. All right, let's get her servo out of here. Governor. Right, or governor, yeah, my bad. Let's pull her out. So her there, let's stick her in there. Now we're ready to gut it. Here we go, guys. We're gonna find out what the heck happened. All right, let's get this pump out of here. Yeah, we already removed most of them. But, all right. Gotta leave something for the contact. Now, we got to go right in here. Wow. Ah, that ain't working. Let's go a little ahead here. All right. Now, see if I can get a hold of it. through this although we went through it last year and it didn't run no time now we're gonna take our come on over here we're gonna take our reverse band off and just start pulling crap out of it how did i get that out of the light nasty nasty i hate transmissions oh all right let's Yank her up out of here. Alright. There's our one, two, or our three, four clutch pack. Reverse drum. Alright, which y'all remember if you watched this, if you've been watching the channel, we already done all this crap. Now we're going to have to get a little deeper into this thing because uh, Something's give way in the back side of it. I don't see that planetary gear being bad, but there's something there's something wrong. All right, guys, we're down to the planetary. Um, we got to take, I think it's called the sun gear. I can't remember. I'm not a transmission guy by no means, so don't be getting on to me. I just know how all this stuff's supposed to be in here and work. So we got to pull this out and drop it on the floor and get it dirty as crap. And then there's a snap ring down in there. We fought with this thing for about two hours to get it out of there. Once that's done, we're gonna... Pour our planetary out. Set it off to the side. We can get it in. Our sun shell, I think is what it's called. Set her off to the side. Now we got another snap ring down in here to get out in the front spring. What we got? Let me get this. This snap ring right here. Right. And crap. I gotta get a bigger screwdriver here. Be right back. Alright. Then we'll get her C clip out of it. And then we got to get that sprag out there. So, let's see. I don't think that will work. I'm going to have to get something to get a hold of here. Another gear. Maybe that's the same gear. I can't remember. But something down in here is busted. So, we got our sprag out. So far, I ain't found nothing messed up. But I'm telling you, something's messed up. 
And I can't remember what that part's called. She's kind of discolored. Like I said, we got to do some, really do some inspecting with all this is freaking out of here. And then we got our, I think this is the first gear clutch pack. Can't remember. But yeah, she's kind of, she's a little burnt up. Then we got our clunk spray. Don't lose the clunk spray. Here's, all this is gonna have to be inspected, tail shaft, whatever the heck that is. And then we gotta get this piston out of here. Burn. See, damn it. Damn. That guy rebuilt this thing is nothing but a freaking moron, man. I know y'all can't see it, but this clip that holds this drum in, that it ain't even snapped in. It's just laying there. All right, so I got my little homemade spring compressor thing there in there. So all I gotta do now is get this. Oh, you little shit. Sorry. A little butthole. Fall down there. There you go. Just retain the ring off of this. Yeah. Hang on, we're gonna have to cramp her down a little bit more. All right, once you get that compressed, you can pop this little ring here out. You only gotta undo all this. All right. And it's probably gonna pop off of there. So watch out. Then we remove our button get it removed. There. Then we'll take our little spring cage out. And it's bent right there. He done the same damn thing. And then this drum is supposed to come up out of here. Let's see. I can't remember. It's moving. There it goes. And then our, our low drum. All right. So there. There's all the bull crap you got to go through for the teardown. Now it's cleaned, inspect, everything. All right? I think we got it. Uh, but you can see. There's all the parts in it I mean, scattered everywhere. And here, there, 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 there. So, like I said, now it's time to clean the case, clean all the parts, inspect everything, and find out where the problem happened. Because that thing, when I was pulling up the hill there here at the house, I got a little hill. As soon as you put pressure on it, man, it's just, <laughs> It had to sound like everything on the inside of that transmission is coming out. So, uh, I did figure out that's a roller clutch. I was showing y'all, called it a sprag. Uh, that might be bad. I don't know, but something's wrong. So, there you go. So, there. Transmission out. Transmission completely tore apart. Transmission kit sitting right there in that box. Right there. So, hang in there. Next step, assessing what needs to be fixed and trying to figure out how to get the money to fix it. So, thanks for watching. We'll see y'all in the next one. Everybody home and safe. We'll see you.